Hello, and welcome to GSSI Training Academy's ongoing series on the new Flex NX concrete scanning system. My name is Jake, and I'm a technical trainer here at GSSI. In our last video, we went over the basic hardware elements of the Flex NX system. Today, we're going to take a look at the Flex NX's dashboard. Dashboard is the home screen of the Flex NX system. From here, we can start a new 2D scan, create a new project folder for our scan data and other media, configure and check our system settings, wirelessly connect to our personal devices, and connect a satellite antenna via near field communication. To start a new 2D scan in our project folder of choice, we simply tap the plus icon. If we want to change the associated area of collection, we just tap the stack menu icon and tap the area or we can create a new area. From the dashboard, we can also create a new project folder by tapping the folder icon adjacent to the recent projects panel title. Switching gears from the projects panel, we can also configure and check the system settings for the Flex NX. Tap the gear icon to enter the system settings menu. In the system settings menu, we can disable or enable the following settings. The system's Wi-Fi, which allows the Flex to connect to personal devices and cast data, among other things. The Flex Vision Positioning System, located on the right side of the Flex cart. Disable or enable the system's lasers. The lasers correspond with each of the system's antennas and can be used for markouts. And we can disable or enable the Save Prompt feature. We can also lower or raise the system's volume. The system uses audio for certain cues. And we can configure the functions of our two buttons. For instance, we can select Mark, New Scan, Delete, or Screen Grab. You'll notice the two dots at the bottom of the screen. If we tap the second dot, it will bring us to the Health Settings screen. From here, we can check the remaining time and charging status of the system, as well as check the manufacturer, serial number, cycle count, and full charge capacity of the system. We can also install software updates by tapping the Software Update icon, or we can download a log file from the system by tapping the appropriate icon. We'll click on the X in the top right of the screen to exit. Back at the dashboard, we can connect a personal device to our Flex NX in order to screencast our data. To do this, we simply tap on the wireless connect icon and follow the steps provided. And finally, if you ever run into trouble on a job site, you can always tap the technical support link and give us a call. We promise top-of-the-line customer support. That's what it means to be trusted. That's the dashboard. We'll see you in the next video on Collection Basics. Take care, and see you then.